Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Michael McCarville. This is episode 118. In this episode, we're going to build the Berkshire Valley Models Animus Forks Jail. Now, this is one of three jail kits that they have, and um, it is back in production and availability, so we're going to build it. Um, now, this kit has some interesting features. It has some jail bars on the front windows, door that you can leave um, open or seal it off. Um, but there's one thing I wanted to mention and that is the jail bars. So there's actually two different methods to, for putting the jail bars in place and uh, I'm going to show you both of those methods. Okay so as far as the jail bars go this is probably the most intricate step on the entire build. The guide that you're supposed to use is pictured there on the top. It's that thin board with the five laser cut holes in it and what you do is you basically glue that temporarily on the top of the wall run five parallel holes that run down through the top of the window frame piece and then goes down into the uh, wall section just below and then what you do is you insert brass wire and uh, glue it in there take that board off trim off the excess off the top and then um, you have the the bars so the intention is that you actually build up the window with those other boards as well and then the side so I don't trust my own ability to align all of those holes perfectly put the boards in so anyway this is what I'm gonna do is going to be I'm gonna take the two boards that you see with the brass wire I'm gonna put those on the inside of the wall and I'm going to take some of the material from that guide, the thin board on the top, and I'm going to build a, basically a frame on the inside of the wall using the boards that have the wire going through them, and then some of the material from the guide that's up above, and I'm going to recess that a little bit. So you're going to, instead of seeing the bars that go right through the wall um, and, you know, flush, almost flush with the outside, it's actually going to be kind of window boxed inside. So that's what I'm going to do. So when we get to that step, that'll explain why what I'm doing looks a little bit differently. I just think it's a lot easier, and I don't trust my ability to get all of the window frame put in, the template on top, to get all of the, the drill to go all the way through perfectly parallel and look good to the way I'm going to want to see it. So when you get to that step, just understand that I'm not following the directions at that point, but I'm using this method instead. So anyway... Let's get started.
Okay, guys, that's going to do it for this build. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching along. I want to thank Richard for allowing us to feature this as a, another video in our video series. So, BerkshireValleyModels.com, check it out. Lots of notes below. Yeah, until next time, thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon. Take care.